Yeah, y'all like this background? What y'all think about this background right here, man? It's cleansed, right? It's cleansed, right? <laughs> anyway, here we are, man, in the sneaker room. I know it look a little different because I haven't turned around yet. <laughs> anyway, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mike Reach, man. I hope everybody, each and every one of y'all, is having a blessed day today, man. Today, we're going to do something different. I hope y'all like this video. We are going to do Building My Sneaker Room. Y'all follow me, of, uh, what was it, last weekend when I went to go get the sneaker boxes, the sneaker displays uh, for my room, a.k.a. the uh, uh, container store sneaker cases that I always have in my background. Um, and I'm just trying to figure out how I'm going to do it right now. I moved a lot of stuff out of here. A lot of my lighting stuff and my uh, 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 tripods from my camera and all that. Move that all out of the room. So let me just show y'all how the room look right now. This is the before. And I must warn you, I'm unorganized, bro. Between uh, a family, a full-time truck driving job, and all that stuff. And I know y'all don't care. Y'all don't care. Y'all like, Reese, show me the shoe. Show me what's going on with the room. But between all that stuff, bro, I don't have time to do anything. So today, I set aside some time to get my sneaker room together. This room actually uh, used to be uh, just an empty bedroom. Um, my old sneaker room was in a room down the hall. Now that's my when my daughter was born. Now that's her bedroom. That's a bigger room. So I had to actually come inside a smaller room and see how I was gonna do this sneaker thing. So let's go ahead and show y'all what we got right now. We got my containers right here, some of them that I bought. This is let's go, let's go this way because let me show y'all what y'all familiar with first. So that's the door that come in the room right there. It's the bedroom, man. That's the closet right here. And this is my sneaker wall where I do all of my video itch right here. And I call it sneaker wall, but it's really just a whole bunch of these containers stacked on top of each other to make I guess a sneaker wall, you know what I'm saying, it goes up, it's not that big, I know a lot of times when I shoot like this, it seems like it's just, I'm sitting down and it seems like I just got a big wall behind me, it's not actually that big, man, um, so it starts right here, and above I got, like, those are some customs that were done for me, like some of my real, like, more limited sneakers that I know I can't just go buy again, like DB7s, this is my, um, my um, Bo Jacksons, the 1996 Olympics ones, uh, Atlanta Olympics, very limited shoe. I'm not gonna go by my shoes, but I'm just saying this is this actually. I don't know why this box is right. This is just some 11s, 11s. Some of this stuff is in the cases. These are Space Jams and these um, Win Like 82. They are in the box because I ran out of cases at the time and like 12 boxes, stuff like that. Let me just flip the camera around so y'all can see. And um, let's get a little foggy. There you go. All right. I'm getting a phone call. Yeah, man. So my wife just called me. Seemed like she know exactly when I start recording because she always call me uh, when I start recording a video. Anyway, so this is the you know y'all already seen all y'all seen all these shoes be sitting in the background of my videos. I got empty spaces from like I think shoes I might have sold or got rid of or given away or something like I don't even know what them empty spaces came from. Uh, my son Jay might might have came in here and got me for some of my shoes. I don't know, uh, but I know everything I got so. <laughs> I'm good. Uh, this is like one of my recent cops right here I've been, that I've done videos on. This is an unboxing I haven't done yet. I got another unboxing sitting in my car I haven't done yet, so y'all look forward to those videos. These boxes, no, not these behind me, but these boxes right here, these boxes, empty. Ain't nothing in these boxes. All of these boxes are shoes that are in these cases right here. And this is probably about 40 or 50 boxes, so all these boxes are empty. I don't know what I'm going to do, man. I don't know if I'm going to get rid of them. Because when I sell shoes, I like to have the boxes and everything that came with the shoe before I sell it. So if I sell something that's over here, I want to be able to have the boxes. The only boxes I throw away is shoes that I plan on keeping and never getting rid of. And to be honest with you, when you got a collection like this, man, you never know when you're going to get rid of shoes. You never know when you're going to sell them, man. It might just be a... So I might have to store these boxes somewhere else in the house. And I know my wife going to hate that I even said put boxes, use another room. But I might have to find a closet or something to put. I don't want to throw these boxes away because I might have to sell these shoes one day. You never know, man. You never know what circumstances and life, the cards that life would deal you. You feel me? Um, these blinds, these curtains right here, I usually have them covered up. But it was an ugly cover, so I had to take it off, man. I just want to have everything look nice and neat. So let's get to the actual shoes that I actually have in boxes. Let's switch the camera back around once again. So all of these boxes right here have shoes in them. I don't know if y'all can tell. It's probably about, uh, about 30 or 40 boxes with shoes in them. 
And I'm, I'm just, I'm gonna count all my shoes at the end. Well, I don't know if I'm gonna count. I guess I might count all my shoes at the end of the video. I don't know. I got like 200 pairs or whatever, something like that. But um, the all these right here, man. Like you know, what I'm saying I got, I got these right here, the DB uh threes, bruh. I tried to sell these shoes, man. They're 11 and a half. I slick can wear them, but I tried to sell them. Dude was like, I saw, I, I, I sent him pictures of them. He was like, he was finna send me the PayPal and everything. He was like, bruh, uh, them look fake. And I think the reason he said that is because these are the 2010. These came out in 2010, and they came out again in 2013. These look way different. Like, there's a lot of small little differences between these and the 2013s, but I know they legit because of my sources where I actually got them from. I know they A1. I just don't have the original box for them, but I know they legit. I'm going to have to go do one of the legit check things or something. I don't know. But, um, these right, I mean, okay. So, <laughs> I'm going to get all over the place, man. But anyway... All of these got shoes in them. All these boxes right here got shoes in them. And, uh, here go some of my cases right here that I bought. And all of these got shoes in them. All of these boxes got shoes in them, man. And I'm sorry for my lighting. I don't have my lighting stuff in here. I just got my overhead light. But as you go up, 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 and it start doing that. And the reason it started toppling over, because I got too high, number one. Number two, these boxes not really made to snack on, uh, stack on top of each other. Number three... I be looking for shoes to wear, like I'm, a, I'm about to go somewhere and I want to wear a fresh pair of kicks. I have to look through these boxes, and sometimes I have to pull stuff out the middle, sometimes I have to pull stuff out the bottom, so I still don't have enough cases, man, for all of these shoes, because with these shoes right here, all these shoes in this corner right here, and all these shoes over here, it's still not enough cases. These, I got 36 cases. This is like 50 maybe 60 pairs of sneakers, it don't look like it. Let's count them, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. This is like almost 20 in this, just this one stack. So let's just say these are the same amount, 40, 60, uh, and it's like half of that stack, so like 68, 65, somewhere between that. This is like almost 70 pairs of sneakers right here, just, just right here. And this right here is at least 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, uh, so, like I said, it's about 40 pair right here. Like 40 and 60. So between these two stacks, that's 100, and it's like 80 right here. You know what I'm saying? And then in the other room, I got like a bunch of LeBrons and like trainers and stuff like that. So it's about 30 shoes in there. So it's, I know it's like 220 pairs somewhere around there. It's a crazy amount of sneakers to have. And the stuff that's not in cases is like easily 140 some odd pairs and only got 36 cases. So. I don't know what's going in the cases right now. I need my, my wife not here right now. I need my wife to help me. I don't know what sneakers I'm going to actually. I, look, I got black cases, 36 black cases. Should I just put grails in heat? Like stuff that I'm, I really love in these black cases. I might do a lot of y'all told me to do checkerboard with these. Since I only got the clear cases and I got the black cases right here. I might do it like checkerboard. And I also think I'm going away from this wall. I'm going to go away from this wall. And I'm going to go in this corner right here. This wall. It's a wall right here. I'm going to say I had to paint it. I might paint later on, not gonna do it right now. Wifey you're gonna have to help me with that. But this wall right here and that wall right here, and I'm gonna do it like in a corner. So I might, when I start shooting my videos, I actually have a corner like going this way and going that way. You know what I'm saying? I'm the owner, I'm just thinking, you know what I'm saying, out loud. But a lot of these black case, I might do the checkerboard. I might do black case, clear case, black case, clear case. And then with these right here, I'm gonna, I literally, what I'm gonna have to do right now, is take every single one of these shoes out of cases. That's that's the part that's gonna irritate the hell out of me right now. I'm gonna have to take every single shoe out of the container because I don't know what order or what specific shoes that I'm gonna actually put in the cases. I don't know yet, and I don't know how I'm gonna do it. Because do I, I mean, a lot of these right here, when I first started, I just wanted to do, I mean, you can kind of tell, like ones, I don't got that many twos, then we got threes, fours, fives, sixes, sevens. I kind of did it like like in the order of the Jordan numbers, but I don't know if I'm trying to keep that flow going or I'm going to um, do something different. I'm still trying to figure it out. I know these boxes right here, I'm going to keep them, but I, they got to get out of this room, man. These boxes, they got to get out of this room because it's just taking up too much space. This room is not a big room, but um, I'm going to try to, I don't know, I got to get a desk. I'm supposed to be going to look for a new desk today, see if I can find something to put in here. Something that just made the room look better. I got like, uh, I had a bookshelf over here. I, I removed it. It had a bunch of like memorabilia type stuff, Jordan Encyclopedia, books, magazines, stuff like that. I took that out of here so I can have room to move this uh, room around like I want to. But anyway, 
<sighs> That's a lot of talking, man. Got seven minutes into the video. Actually, it's more than that because I had to stop because my wife called me. So anyway, y'all gonna see the after. I'm probably gonna record some in between of how when I get all the shoes out and when I get everything put back up. So y'all stay tuned, man. I appreciate y'all watching the video, man. So let's go ahead and get to work, man. Let's do it. So update. Hey, y'all. Wife is here. Hi. <laughs> update, man. Uh, so this is how we're coming along with it so far. And we don't have enough cases, man. So let me tell y'all something. Uh -oh. I'm gonna come on here and do a video about what it's like to be married to a sneakerhead. Because Saturdays, building sneaker walls and rooms, having to go to the store and spend hundreds of dollars on more cases, and I'm sure there's gonna be a cop or two at some point this weekend. Why are you looking at me? <sighs> um. Anyway, this is this is the <laughs> these are the shoes right here. Still that need to be in boxes. Uh, this is the only, this is the cases I got left over. I gotta take these shoes out. And these right here on the floor is just. Having to give up a whole bedroom for the sake of shoes. You still talking about the that? The list goes on. Uh, this is all the shoes I've taken out of the cases so far. All of these are not going back in. I'm gonna try to stick to like all the OG sneakers and like the more exclusive shoes and stuff to, for the display. But, but can we ask you what you're gonna do with the ones that's not going back in? Like, what can we get rid of the ones that's not going back in? Can you? I'm gonna sell some stuff. Yeah, maybe a giveaway or something. I don't know. I'm gonna sell some stuff. We might do some giveaways. Tell but, me uh, what y'all think. Should I do a video by myself and let y'all know what it's like? You all on my hair. I'm sorry. Um, I don't think I have no habits that cost this much. Uh, you don't. But um, we ain't talking about all that. This video ain't about that. It's building a sneaker room. Getting it together, so we got to ride all the way. How, how far? About a forty-five minute ride. I ride out there every day for work. It ain't that deep. <sighs> I know, man. <laughs> but um, to get more cases because the checkerboard is looking quite nice, though. You know, I'm gonna check that checkerboard out. It, it's coming together pretty, pretty dope. I like the checkerboard so far. Um, but it's just, it's, it's not gonna, it's not gonna be sufficient enough. It's not gonna be enough. So, you gotta get more cases. What you doing? I just had to pull my hair up. It's hot. I got to. It take a lot of hard work and dedication for this. Don't be looking like that. So you ready to go? Because let me be clear. You, you getting this out just like this, and they are too. Hey, y'all. You, you ready to go get these dog on cases? I am. We need this to is overwhelming, man. I know, because you look really stressed, but this is what you want. This is what you want. You decide to go and buy all this stuff, and it's starting to be a point where the sneaker cases are just as expensive as the dog on shoes. All right, man. So that's the update. This is what we're doing right now. We'll show you how it looks later on. Go. <laughs> so once again, once again, babe. Once again, what? You weren't with me last time, but I'm here again. I'm at the container store once again. And you can see, I was telling them last time how as soon as you walk, the, as soon as you walk in, in the front, that's all you see is the sneaking containers. Great, we ain't got to go that far. No, they, they over here though. Oh, yeah. so they ain't even awesome. in the same spot they were last time. Let's see. So what were you saying? I think that you need a custom closet. Like you need to just redesign the whole room and make it into a closet. That's a good idea, babe. Sounds expensive. Here are the black ones right here. So we need more blacks. We still got plenty of silvers. So we might be buying all of these. This is five cases. So how many of that? Five times six is 30. Oh, I knew that. You didn't. I think <laughs> I'm, I'm starting to believe. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. Yeah, man, so. Just made it back from the container store. How many we got? 42 additional ones. We got 42 more cases. And unfortunately, that still ain't gonna be enough for all my shoes, but I'll be able to get most of them in there. Now, look at the pile I got going on. See anything you like? Ooh. I just started throwing, at first I, I started off trying to put them down neatly. Is that, why is that not focusing? Focus! There you go. I know my camera don't like focusing. I tried with the ones and I started off stacking them neatly and then everything just got out of hand from there and I just started throwing them down. Throwing them down. This, this is very deep, man. This is deep, I'm telling you. This is deep. It goes deep down. What we got down here? Yeah, there goes some fives. There goes some sevens. Let's go deeper, let's go deeper. There goes some Tinker 3, there goes some Gatorades. 
Got some Concords over there, man. You know what I'm saying? Pantone sevens, man. We got maroon sixes down there. Maroon sixes. Yeah, man. So it, it gets a little deeper. That 2014 black and for red, right? You hear me? All this stuff not going back in case. Then all the ones over here. So anyway, let's get back to it. Wifey is starting to uh, work over here, doing some more cases. How you feel? I'm good. You sure? I'm positive. I just want you to get out of my way so we can get this done. Okay, so the the um, stacks continue with the uh, 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 checkerboard pattern. So. Oh, you all right? You, you okay? <laughs> Whoa. I might have broke like seven of them. Don't be breaking them now. Look now. Go on. You, you make, messing up my concentration. All right, anyway, <laughs> let's get to it. Do it. So, hey there. We actually have the finished product. Well, it's kind of the finished product. It's um, it's all that's gonna get done today. You hear my baby? She's jumping around. She's having a good time. Look, babe. Say hey. Now you wanna be quiet? Say hey. Come in the light. There you go. Say hey, pretty girl. You just looking at yourself. Say hey. Mommy. Mommy, what? <laughs> Don't act scared now. Anyway. She's been jumping around this room all day. There she go again. Um, but we pretty much done. I have 150 cases now. And this is what it looks like. Let me show you. So, I was able to get more cases, of course. And I did a checkerboard, which really you can't even... Now you can't even really tell that it's the checkerboard, now that the shoes are there. Come on, focus. There you go. Harley! Chill out, shout it. Uh, <laughs> but you can't even really tell. What are you doing? Uh, <laughs> but like, like I said, I was able to get most of my Jordans in. I got some Air Max in at the bottom. Some Air Max in at the bottom. Well, these are all my Air Max, I think. Well, most of them. Yeah, it's the Hey. And uh, those are LeBrons on that side. Then I got my Presto collection right here. As well as some other little different types of sneakers. But then from right here up, all the way around. That's the middle. Then we come on this side. It's Jordans. Jordans. All J's. Go down the middle. All my Jordans. What, babe? I see you. I see you, pretty girl. And uh, I said Jordan. So I was able to get most of my Jordans in. Most of them. I still got a lot of Jordans I didn't put in. And they are in boxes still. Got my 100,000 subscriber thing up there. Got some cu customs that was made for me. Shout out to Eric. Uh, got my little Falcons helmet next to my Vicks. I got another pair of Vicks I want to throw up here. Just some Atlanta swag going. Got my Encyclopedia of Jordans. This was a gift from my guy Fine Line. Shout out to him, man. Uh, praying for you and the fam right now. Oh, as always. Somebody made this for me a while back. I can't remember who it was. That was dope. Uh, got some Jordan magazines. I was kind of stuff. I, I haven't really had a chance. I, got, I need to get a desk in here or something. Baby, you lit. <laughs> you are lit today. You know that. <laughs> don't, <laughs> don't fall. And I got my hats up here lined up. This is wifey's idea to go there and do the hats like this. If we were gonna get like a hat rack or something to hang them up. Still might do it in the future. Um, I got a couple of paintings from my guy. Uh, Slime three fifteen. I think that's it. I can't remember. Uh, but he do does a lot of dope paintings. Still got those. Unboxing coming soon right there. Um, and these are the shoes that's left in the boxes right here. So it's still a pretty good amount of shoes, sneakers left in the boxes. Harley, what are you doing, baby? And um, yeah, that's it, man. So wifey helped me out pretty good, and uh, we got a lot of stuff done. The room is not finished because I still have this big blank white wall right here. And I still have this big blank white wall. Might put my desk, my desk right here. And I might put some um, 
some some posters or pictures or stuff up there. I'm not really done done, but y'all get the gist of it. The sneaker part is done. Alright, uh Hardy just departed the room. She I guess she got tired of jumping around here. Like I said, I wanna get one of those mirrors that come from the floor all the way up to the ceiling, like a so you can check your fit out, make sure you clean for your head out the house. You know what I'm saying? But the sne really the only part that's done is the sneaker. The sneaker room is not done, but the sneakers themselves are stored, basically. And this is gonna be my new background, which is it's still pretty much the same background. It's just like a V shape. You got shoes going that way, you got shoes going this way. So I don't know. What y'all think about that for a thumbnail? Actually, I might not use this as a thumbnail. I might use when I pour, poured all the shoes out and I was like swimming and buried in the shoes, I might use that for a thumbnail instead. But this is gonna be my new background. I'm kind of gonna be sitting like right here. What's going on, everybody? I got shoes in the background and I'm talking about a new pair of sneakers. What you doing, Harley? What you doing? You wanna come in? Come on. My baby wanna come in. <laughs> and now you're already jumping around. So, that's it, man. That's the video. Sit on the floor now. Boy. Come here. <laughs> I'm about to sign out, Harley. That's it. Let's do the outro. Yeah. So I appreciate y'all watching this video, going on this journey with me. You gonna sit with me? Come on. Yeah. Appreciate y'all for going on this journey with me, man. It ain't over yet. I will give y'all updates as I decide to do more stuff with the sneaker room and get it more presentable. You know what I'm saying? More uh, things going on to just make it look like, feel like a real sneaker room. Some NBA stuff, some some stuff that I'm interested in, just on the walls. And it's gonna be fine, man. It's gonna find, it's gonna be fine. I'm gonna give y'all more updates in the future. You feel me? Um, but that's it for right now, man. This took a lot of work. And I spent a lot of money on yeah. cases. She's gone now. She didn't she just boy, take that long. Boy. Um, but um, that's it. It, it took a lot of work. Like I had to literally dump every sneaker on the floor, and like every shoe had to take all of them out, restack all the cases, go buy more cases, and just put them all back together. So, shout out to the wifey. Appreciate it, babe. They can't hear you. You're welcome. She said you're welcome. She's back there cleaning up right now. Um, but that's it, man. So I appreciate y'all for watching. Y'all comment below and tell me what you think of the new sneaker wall. It's really just a bunch of uh, sneaker cases. I ain't do nothing special, special like that. But I think it look good. I think it's, it's dope for what it is. Check out my Supreme shoes. Everybody hated them 14s, man. But <laughs> anyway, I probably will never do a sneaker collection video again unless I'm going through these cases. Like, that'd be the easiest way to do it. I got this, I got this, I got this. Instead of pulling every shoe out, because that's, ah, uh, I can't even imagine trying to take all these shoes out, these cases again. I will be not moving from this house anytime soon. Hopefully, God willing, because I do not want to move these shoes again, man. That's got to be the last time I do that. So anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Give the thumbs up, like, subscribe. Come here, Harley. Let's do the outro, baby. Harley! Harley! Huh? Come on. Okay. Let's do the outro. Okay. Y'all hit the thumbs up, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Hit the notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up to the moon on them. And keep watching my video because that's what I'm here for. Gone. Say gone. <laughs> say gone. <laughs> you don't want to say it. We out of here, man. Gone. <laughs>